Okay, so episode 22. Uh, this episode is going to suck because we are probably going to die. Because we are going to attempt, keyword attempt, to slay the final three bosses. Uh, Malglitch, Rahavart, and Asmodeus. All mobs blooded infernal. And I'm also going to use an emerald soul key. Which is going to suck ass, but it's fine. Uh, before we die, though, we do need to name our scythe, because we got some names, and, uh, you know, naming is cool and whatnot. Uh, and the name I picked was Dragon Gutter. I don't know why. I just thought that this was neat, even though this thing probably isn't going to be used to kill dragons anymore, because I don't give a shit about them. <laughs> uh, but it's cool. Okay, so now that that's out of the way, we need to change the color of our wings, because white wings are boring. And uh, the color that I picked uh, was orange. Now... I had a few people suggest I go orange, and I thought, ah, I've never done orange wings before, let's do it. Uh, now, I'm not smart, and I don't know how to make orange, but I think it's somewhere... Yeah, this this is decent. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, we'll go with this, perfect. Alrighty, and with that said, it is now time to die. Before we go, though, I do want to screw around with my baubles just a little bit, just because we can get a little bit more damage. We can kind of, you know, min-max them for fighting the final bosses. Uh, luckily, because of the Shivaxi Monument that I only spent a week searching for, uh, we have a Wrath Pendant, which is neat. This will give us a ton of damage, uh, which is fantastic. We are going to have to reroll this, but that's fine. Okay, so I rerolled my, my Wrath Pendant. Life is good. Um, I'm just kind of thinking here, right? Like, because I don't really need a Balloon Bobble, technically, right? I could replace this for something better for combat, but there isn't really anything I can replace it with that's like that big of a difference, right? Like, I could replace it with like an arcing orb, for example, which this bobble is good. It gives you a ton of movement speed and whatnot, but do I really care about it? You know what, lads? I am lazy as shit. Uh, I'm not going to think about this because my brain hurts. I'm just going to swap this Wrath Pendant out for the uh, Stone of the Sea, and we're just going to hope for the best. Turning the soul keys into emerald soul keys. Life is pain. Okay, so I may have forgotten about something. I forgot to actually reroll this um, last episode because you need fucking nether stars to do it, which is penis in this. Because uh, I went to the nether once and uh, we all know how that went. Uh, it was a lot of fun, but I, I, you know, I guess we'll just try to go for something decent and then we just hope. Okay, that's not what we're looking for. That is not ideal uh, uh, you know uh, a couple more times we got this okay mm. you know what good enough good we'll, we'll just leave it like that it, it's fine okay so i may have completely forgotten that you need a, a demon soul stone for this because i'm not intelligent uh but that's fine we'll go to the nether real quick we'll get we'll, we'll get one it's fine all right so now begins the super fun journey of uh attempting to find a lycanite's dungeon in the nether uh they're usually not that hard to find, usually, but uh, we'll see what happens. Oh my god, would I just realize something? I don't have my canteen on me. You know, it's fine. Well, lads, uh, I appear to have been wrong. It is, in fact, not fine. I'm going to have to go home and get my canteen and then keep looking, but it's fine. Hey, look at that. Hey, we found one. Very nice. Okay, so because these cunts scare the shit out of me, I'm just going to shoot them with my bow and uh, hope for the best. Okay, it worked. Very nice. Very cool. Oh my god, look at that scythe. Oh, game pros. Fantastic. Hey, the demon soul stone, baby. Okay, slight little detour, but it's fine. We got our soul cube. There we go. Okay. So now, we should have everything we need to do this. Okay, so I'm going to build the arena uh, at the roof of the nether, just because if you do, his arena, you know, breaks the, uh, what you call it, the bedrock roof above you. Although I'm sure most people already know that. Uh, but it is quite fun to see, so I'm going to do it. Alrighty, two blocks up. Soul cube, two blo- Hey, we have just enough space, nice. And then I believe it's, what is it, it's three, and then it's a block of diamond, I think, on all four sides. Okay, so... This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to put the soul key in. I'm going to summon Rahovar. I'm going to run away from his green pillar of death. I'm going to do what I do every single Saturday. I'm going to eat a burrito, eat a risotto, drink some wild berry wine, and then drink some normal wine. And then we're going to fight him. And it's going to go well. Oh yeah, also, before we do this as well, 
Uh, I'm telling you all now, as much as I'd love to prove that you can beat Arlcraft with all mobs, blood, and infernal, because I'm, I'm kind of curious to see, you know, if you can kill all the bosses with it. If it comes down to it, if we cannot kill him, if it just, he's just so unfathomably tanky, it's just actually not, like, feasible at all, I am leaving. That is it. I, I have done too much in this world. I am leaving. You can be sad about it. That's okay. And if you hate me for it, that's, you know, that's all good. But I am fucking leaving. Alrighty, boys. Look alive. Oh my god, there's already shit on me. What? I've already got picked up? Are you serious? Okay, hold up. We need to chug some wine here, get our stats up, kill these cunts that are on us. Okay. Alright, I'm a little, little scared, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, I want to try to get some wine in here first before... Oh my Christ. Okay, let's see how tanky you are. He's invincible. Oh no, he's not. He's not invincible. Okay, I'm, not, I'm just gonna keep swinging. And we're gonna hope for the best. I'm gonna check my armor, see how it goes. And, uh, you know, we'll see what happens. Holy fuck, he hurts. Uh... He has lifesteal. Wait, is he healing a lot? Okay, wait, this is... Going... Somewhat... Uh, uh, boys, we may have to resort to the bow. Uh, okay, wait, no, it's working. I may end up doing some time lapsing of this because, uh, wow, okay, I am out of water. What the fuck? Uh, hmm. Oh, that's not good. Oh, my Christ. Um, hmm. Alrighty, boys. So I backed up a little bit to uh, get some water in my system. Holy fuck. He's invincible. How do we kill him? He, he doesn't die. It, it's immortal. My armor's still fine, which is nice. But I don't know... How... This is... Okay, this... Okay, maybe it's doable. It might be doable. Uh, I do want to heal a little bit, though. So if I could kill some of these cunts, that would be fantastic. And that's... Uh, this is fuck... Ah, oh, nah, my head's... Nah, I'm out of here. I'm leaving. Fuck that. Nope. Nope. Not doing it. My head's on orange. Absolutely not. Holy <laughs> Okay, so I may have completely forgotten that... Uh, I forgot that Rehobart has an attack where he actually strips your buffs away from you. Uh, so that's why I took so much damage there. Uh, but still, even so, even when I had my buffs, he was invincible. Like, how, how... How do I kill it? Like, maybe maybe if I rebuff up and I go in there and I only use my bow and I don't get hit by that green... Because I think it's the green, green wall of fire that gets rid of your buffs. I don't remember exactly. Maybe it's doable? Okay, so I'm going to fly around real quick. I'm going to look for his arena if I can find it. Um, if I can't, I'll just go home and come back. And we're gonna, uh, we're gonna try our hardest to kill this cunt, because we need to kill this cunt in order to get to Asmodeus, and we need to kill Asmodeus in order to get to Amalgalich. Again, if we can't, you know, tough shit, we tried, what can you do? Gentlemen, I may have soft-locked myself, uh, so... <laughs> ah, shit, man. I, uh, came back, and I can't break blocks. So, you... <laughs> Okay, yeah, I probably shouldn't have put the spawner in the roof, because if I didn't, I would be able to get up there, but uh, that Rehobart is now just going to be there until the end of time. He will rule hell and just fucking exist. Okay, so I was just doing some thinking, and uh, if I really wanted to, I could cheat and just break the blocks that are in my way so I can get into the boss arena. Um, I'm kind of tempted to do that. I'm also kind of not tempted because I don't really want to cheat. But I also don't want to go through the pain of making another boss summoner. So you know what? Fuck it. This is for science. It's the end of the series. Let's cheat. We're, we're, we're cheating. We're doing it. Alrighty, lads, we're back. And as you can see, we are in creative mode. We're going to smack these blocks so we can actually get in. Life is good. Alright, now, just because I'm curious, before we do actually begin to try and fight him, and I know this is a little cheap, but I'm curious, how much HP do you have? You have... Oh, you only have 3,500? What the fuck? That's it? Huh? Okay, this is doable. I know this is doable. Alright, so a little unfortunate that we had to use creative mode there. Shit happens. What can you do? 
Um, we're gonna buff up out here. We're gonna buff up out here though, which is a little cheap. But uh, I mean, we could do this in theory in survival mode, right? Because if we could get into the arena, we have the ring of the dragon, so we could just you know fly out and just go out here and buff up. So it's not like it's completely unreasonable. Uh, but we're gonna do it. Alrighty, boys. The buffs have been eaten. The wine has been drinkened. I don't know how much time we have. We have quite a bit of time. We'll just leave it at that for now. Fuck it. All right, you son of a bitch, it's time for round two. Okay, so we need to not get hit by any of the green shit. And then maybe we kill him eventually. Uh, so gentlemen, uh, no need for concern. But those, uh, green... Oh, Jesus. Okay, did I get hit by... I did get hit by that bullshit! Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, but he's just back up to full HP. It's not doable. It, there's no way. How do you do it? There's no way. Alrighty, lads, so I've been doing some thinking, and, uh, I realized something. I realized that the amount of shit that I've forgotten thus far, uh, is astounding. Because I forgot about this thing, the poison stone. Alrighty, lads, so here's the thing, though, right? So... This guy has Bulwark and Lifesteal, so he is very tanky, and if he hits us, he just gets his entire health bar back. But there is... I'm not going to give up yet. You know me. Like, I got, I, I just got to keep trying, right? We're going to try something. I'm going to go back home. I'm going to get myself a Poison Stone. I know I have one somewhere. And I'll just have to find it, but it's fine. I'm going to get a Poison Stone. I'm going to come back here. We're going to buff up again. We're going to try and kill this cunt, and if that doesn't work, if it truly is impossible... Then we're just going to summon another Rahavart, and we're just going to hope that it doesn't have a uh, lifesteal. Because I think that's like the one... Because even Bulwark isn't horrible. Uh, it's still manageable, but uh, lifesteal is just the one thing that he just can't have, or else he like he's just immortal. Like, he, he just doesn't die. Okay, so I just ran home real quick. I grabbed a Poison Stone. Life is good. Um, so here's the thing. Because this cunt can wipe our buffs from us, I'm not going to bother with the wine. I'm just going to drink the... or drink. Jeez. I'm going to eat the burrito, I'm going to eat the risotto, and then I'm just going to go in there. I'm going to see if I do any decent damage. If I do, cool, we'll try to develop a strategy to kill him. Again, I don't think this is going to make that much of a difference. Even though this bobble is insanely good, I don't think it's going to be the deciding factor. I'm pretty sure this guy's invincible. We'll try, we'll see what happens, and we'll go from there. Alrighty, boys. Wish me luck. This, uh, again, don't know how this is gonna go. But let's find out. Are you taking damage? Oh my god, well, you're taking so much damage. What the fuck? Wait a minute. Hold up, the poison stone's broken. Okay, wait, this might actually be doable. Was this actually the deciding factor? Are you serious? Don't tell me this was the deciding factor. Can I can I kill you before you hit me with a green wall of fire? I'm just gonna keep swinging. I'm not, I, don't, I don't care about my water. I'm just gonna keep swinging. Just gonna keep swinging. Just gonna keep swinging. He's dead. That was it. Are you fuck? I am so unbelievably stupid. It's not even funny. Alrighty, boys. Can you beat Rahovart with an emerald key while all mobs are blight infernal? Uh, yes, you can. You just need to have a brain. Uh, one that I was uh, lacking in the very beginning of this. But uh, you know, it is what it is. Um, now I'd love to get at the loot in the center. Okay. So okay, here's the real question though. How much? That's his XP power right there, I believe. How much are you gonna give me? I'm at 306 levels. Let's see. I think y'all go up to, like, just ridiculous amounts of levels, right? Oh my god. <laughs> Wait, there's so much. Wait, it's just keep... It's still going? What? Wait, there's so much. Oh, okay, just a quick, you know, 200 levels there. It's pretty good. Alright, I just quickly uh, emptied out my inventory, but let's uh, pick up all, this go all these goodies. I don't have enough room, but that's fine. I'll have to make some. Toss out this bullshit. We'll get the ray sigil. Cool. We'll get all this shit. Very nice. Okay. Oh yeah, I forgot about the nether stars as well. I guess I should make some room uh, for that. I don't really give a shit about this. This is whatever. Uh, we'll get the nether stars. How many did you drop? Eight. It's pretty good. Okay, and I believe I collected everything that I need, or everything that I want, rather. Uh, we do need these for uh, Asmodeus, which is fine, because we got them. And uh, I think we're good to go. Alrighty, lads, so I just came back home real quick. Uh, we need to kill Asmodeus next. And uh, he... You you need to fight him in the end, uh, which kind of sucks because... <laughs> so, <laughs> when I originally went to the end in episode 13, 14, I think, somewhere around there, uh, I didn't have access to a nether star at the time. 
And because of that, I didn't have one of these. I couldn't craft one of these. So I don't have a teleporter to the end, uh, which sucks. It's fine. It just means we're going to have to go through the old fashioned way. The problem is, is that the old fashioned way, I don't even remember where the fuck it is. It's on my map somewhere. It's marked somewhere. Uh, I just need to, uh, you know, find it. Oh, wait, hold up, lads. I found it. I only spent about a minute searching. So the end or the end portal is here. And I am just about over here. So it's a little bit of a journey, but it's fine. We can do it. Alrighty, lads. So we're here. It took quite a while. Uh, it took about almost 20 minutes or so. Uh, it was uh, quite the journey. Definitely a lot longer than I, I would have, you know, expected. Uh, but anyways, I digress. We're going to go into the end real quick. We're going to get some end stone. We're going to go through one of the teleporter things. We're going to uh, summon an Asmodeus. And hopefully kill him. Hopefully. Okay, so back in the end, life is good. Let's put down this waystone. Let's call it end. There we go. Okay, so now we have a direct link back to home if we so need it. Which is great. Alright, so we just hopped through the teleporter there. We should be completely good to go to build our little altar, except I think... Oh no, I did do it right. Okay, never mind, we're chilling. Oh! Uh, that's not good. I was just getting ready to go. And uh, I'm gonna dig down, actually. I'm gonna... I'm just gonna dig down. We're just gonna... We're just gonna dig down. And uh, it'll be fine. That's really awkward. Huh? Oh, hello. Oh, this is... Oh, yeah, this is not ideal. Yeah, we're just gonna... We're just gonna leave. I can't... Okay, I'm a little stuck in lava here. That is very strange. We got a fucking black plague, eh? Okay. I was uh, just getting ready. I was just kind of organizing my inventory a little bit. I was gonna grab a little bit of wine, and then I was gonna start. But uh, apparently, Arlcraft had different plans. Okay, so that was a uh, little bit of a detour, but it should be totally fine. Uh, so what we're gonna do, same shit, different power, we're gonna stick the key in, uh, we're gonna eat some buffs, uh, then we're gonna fight Asmodeus. Uh, Asmodeus doesn't have an attack, as far as I'm aware, that can strip buffs from us, uh, which is very nice. Um, but I'm gonna keep my wine on me, just in case, but I'm not gonna use it, uh, cause we were able to kill Rahovart with one rotation of buffs. I'm curious to see if we can kill... Uh, Asmodeus with one, one rotation. I don't think so, just because Asmodeus is quite a bit tankier, usually. Um, but if he's like a, if he's just like a rare Infernal and not like an orange named one, like the fucking Rahover was, uh, it might even be easier. I'm not sure, uh, but we'll have to see. Alrighty, lads, this is it. Zen. All right, here we go. Uh, scared. I don't want to move just yet. Okay. Oh shoot. Oh, mouse is broken. Hold up. We're, oh, we're, we're we're gonna get it. Don't worry. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my Christ, what the fuck was that? Holy shit! I don't remember that attack being a thing. What is that? Can I- can I hit you now? Okay. I can hit you, I think? No, I'm not. Okay. Ooh. What the hell was that? Oh, he is a- okay, Oh my god, that shit hurts so much. It hurts so much. Okay, we're- we're gonna- You know what, we're gonna- we're gonna- we're just gonna- We're just gonna do that. Oh yeah, that's right, fuck, I forgot about the DK debuff. I believe that one was the one that's, uh... Oh, what did that do again? Reduce your healing, I think? Hmm. Okay, Asmodeus might be... He hurts so much. Oh, my head's in red. Oh, I'm leaving. Oh, I'm, I'm fucking leaving. No, thank you. What the fuck was that, man? Okay, so that didn't work out at all. Um, I spent some time... My buffs kind of ran out, which is, is fine. We can, you know, rebuff up on all that good stuff. Um, I spent some time trying to get my health bar back a little bit. Just from smacking, you know, the mobs around here. But holy shit, man. He hurts. My goddamn head. It hurts. Okay, gentlemen, so melee didn't work. We're gonna try melee. Can I can I even hit this guy with or sorry, not melee range. Jesus. Can I even hit this guy? Oh my god. Dude, what is this? It hurts so much. What the fuck, dude? Can I hit you, please? Oh my god. Okay, I can hit you. I have to be kinda close to you. Uh it hurts, man. It's so sketchy, dude. Alrighty boys, so I got an idea. Uh, and that is, I want to try reapplying my buffs and chugging an ass load of wine. Uh, because the Battle Burrito gives you the Rejuvenation buff, and uh, that increases the amount of healing you receive. 
So I'm thinking maybe, oh, uh, that's horrifying. Um, but I'm thinking maybe, just maybe, if we have a ton of rejuvenation, it'll sort of counteract the DK, I think. Alrighty, boys. Uh, fuck it. Let's go in. Let's see what happens. Let's just, let's just go in. Okay, I'm smacking. It's okay. Okay, this is working. Okay, rejuvenation is the key. It is the key. Uh, now when this guy gets to phase two, uh, he will swap to- Dude, it's so sketchy. It's so loud. Yeah, he summons these little guys. And I believe these guys also heal him as well. Okay, we got him. Nice. I'm gonna keep smacking. I'm just gonna keep going. We're not gonna think. We're just gonna smack. We're just gonna keep smacking. And hopefully Satan dies. With the power of the buffs. Come on. Holy shit, we got him. Okay, we got him. Okay. Alright, boys, we're chilling. We're chilling. It's it's rough, but we're we're chilling. Okay. Alrighty, lads. That's uh two down. One more to go. That is Asmodeus, Legend Infernal, Emerald Soul Key. We're doing it slowly but surely. Uh, you know, it's uh, it is happening. And just for fun, let's see how many levels we get. We have 502. <laughs> There's so much XP, man. There's so much. It's just an endless... It's it's just endless. Let's fix up all our stuff. Here we go. Oh, wait. Here we go. Yeah, yeah. Huh. 738 levels. Okay. We're, <laughs> we're doing good, boys. I'm pretty sure Amalgalich is probably going to get us to 1,000. Something tells me Amalgalich is gonna get us to a thousand. Alrighty, so I just ran home real quick. I uh, got some shit. I, I made the uh, the summoner thing for Amalgalich. Uh, life is good, as you can see. We're already in the Lost Cities and I already built this thing. But this is it, lads. This is everything we've been working for, is this cunt right here. Okay, so when it comes to attacks, uh, there's only one attack that I'm really scared of, uh, and that's his one shot. That's his, you know, go down to the ground and suck you in one shot you attack. Um, and funnily enough, the most dangerous modifier this guy can have is probably cloaking. Because usually, uh, if you just kind of sit there and hit him, uh, he's not too bad to deal with just because um, you can see when he's about to do the suck attack and you just walk away uh, and you just kind of hang out and chill. I won't be able to see that if he's cloaked. So, we're gonna summon one, we're gonna hope that he doesn't have cloaking, and we're gonna go from there. Alrighty boys, this is it, hopefully he doesn't have cloaking. <sighs> Let's go. Alright. I really hope this goes well, and doesn't turn to complete shit. Oh, what happened to my game there? Holy shit, what the fuck was that? <laughs> well, this is only slightly horrifying. Let's see, does he have cloaking? He doesn't have cloaking. My whole game just exploded. Alright. Let's go to town, baby. It's so fucking loud. Oh, shit. How's my armor looking? Okay, armor's looking okay here. Ooh, there's a cop there. Okay. Ah, uh, this is sketchy. See, that's the... Oh, see, okay, there we go. Okay. It's a good thing he doesn't have cloaking. Because, uh, you know, not being able to... Okay, my armor's looking good. That's all I really need. Just gotta make sure the armor's good. Uh, okay, boys, so I must say, uh, this is going quite well thus far. Um, my armor's looking decent here. We're, we're doing it. I'm gonna have to time-lapse this, but, uh, it's, it's happening slowly but sure. Okay, so I just realized I'm starving. Holy shit, okay, uh... Oh, these goddamn guys. This is... I'm gonna leave, actually. I'm, I'm gonna leave real quick, I think. Hold up. <laughs> Hold up, boys. Little little detour here. <laughs> yeah, I did not realize that my uh, my hunger bar went down so quickly. That was actually kind of crazy. Okay, we got a bit more hunger now. But you, actually, you know what? You know what we'll do? We'll re-enable... Uh, where is it? Farming. We'll re-enable this real quick. 
and then we'll get back in here and start fighting. And, uh, oh, not when I get feared, though. Oh! Boy, oh, he got his whole health bar back. I don't know what the fuck happened, but he got his whole health bar back. Wait, we killed him! Wait, how did he kill- Wait! No way! Wait, did I get it? Wait, no way! Did I get it? Did I get the insta-kill from the Atomic Deconstructor? Holy shit! Oh my god, boys, I'm not gonna lie! That was sketchy, because I thought for sure- Because he healed back to full somehow. I don't know how the fuck he did it, but he healed back to full. Look- I'm sorry, I'm getting distracted here. We did it! We won! We beat it! I apologize if I'm being a little incoherent and frazzled here, because I'm not gonna lie, I've been shitting myself this entire episode. Fighting all these bosses, Blighted Infernal with an Emerald Soul Key, is stress-inducing, man. My heart, I feel like it's gonna explode. Um, but we got him. We did it. I don't know how, but we did it. Uh, anyways, for fun, let's see how many levels we get from this. I have 746. Let's go on in here. Come on, give me a thousand. <laughs> There's so many, dude. No! Are you serious? It didn't take me to a thousand. It only got me to 996. Man, that's fucking lame. Well, lads, this was quite the uh, stress-inducing experience. Uh, I don't recommend to do this at all. This was horrible. My poor heart. I might die, uh, but I'll be fine. Um, I will say, though, it's a really good thing, because this usually drops from a mal glitch. It's a really good thing that we found this at a Shivaxi monument. It's a really, this was a week, you know, I spent a week looking for a Shivaxi monument and luckily it had one of these, but holy shit, we got so lucky with that because these guys are tough as hell. They are so tanky, so hard to kill uh, if you don't have one of these because these give you crazy amounts of damage. Well, lads, this was a fun episode. Uh, it was stress inducing, but it was quite fun. Um, this is a, this is interesting though, right? Because we have proven something, we have proved that you can indeed beat RLCraft, you can kill the three final bosses, all mobs, Blood Infernal, start to finish, with Emerald Soul Keys. It's not fun, don't recommend it, but you can do it. Also, further testament to that, uh, you remember like, when I started this series, like a, a year ago almost, I think? <laughs> and I was like, oh, my mouse is half broken and it doesn't click very well. Yeah, I'm still using the same mouse, by the way, so <laughs> You can you can do it. Don't let your dreams be dreams. You can do anything. You just gotta put your mind to it. But I digress. With that being said, we're gonna call the episode here. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you next time. Peace.